So something happened about two weeks ago uh, at the 11 o'clock service. I did a, what I would call, a financial altar call at the end. There's somebody who have not raised their hand. Everybody can just look up at me now. They haven't raised their hand yet. And you have a bill right now around $512. That's an odd amount. Somewhere in there. $500. I'm thinking $512. That's what's in my brain right now. And it's due. You're trying to figure out what to do. What you're failing to do is trust God. And he's waiting on you to move. And maybe he just gives me this number that's close right here, if not exact, I don't know, to help you see he knows exactly where you at. So I'm going to do this again, though. I want your head bowed now. And if you did not raise your hand, and you are not a tither, and you have a bill due right now that's 500 and some change. Raise your hand. They're not online either. They're in this room. I'm going to wait. If you have a bill due right now that's at least 500 and some change, and you didn't raise your hand to tithe, if that's you, raise your hand. I believe God is trying to zero in to let you know he knows exactly where you at. What I thought at first was that this bill was, was for somebody who wasn't tithing, but this person was actually a tither. And what God was wanting to show was that if you obey him, he will supply. The scripture says, I've never seen the righteous forsaken, nor his seed beg bread. And so there are people sometimes who don't know how God can really come through. So this person had just gotten a bill that Friday, I think, in the mail. They didn't know what they were going to do. It really wasn't their bill. It came in their name. They felt the conviction that I was talking to them out of everybody in the room. They were the only ones that raised their hand. And I said, they're not online. This person is here. So this person raised their hand, and, uh, you know, I had to ask them to bring the bill because what God told me to do, he says, pay it. They sent me a copy of the bill. Here it is right here. $511.98. Two cents away. If God knows somebody's bill to the T, how much he not know your situation? Tithing does more than what you think. It takes care of stuff that we don't even know is going to happen yet. God already had this situation paid in advance before the person even realized they had a bill. I'm saying to you today, church, don't tithe just out of religion. Don't, char don't tithe just out of, out of uh, regiment. Tithe out of revelation. What's the revelation? That God knows my situation better than I do. And you holding on to that tithe is not going to help your situation. He already knows that what you would have tithe is less than what you need a revelation and a breakthrough on. I wonder how many people God already has something in the works for you because you've decided to trust him. Amen.